everyone welcome back to another episode of little hope so yeah things are going great i'm having a splendid time uh can we please get out of here there you go yeah i'm having a really good time <laughs> best time ever basically to pick up books or to flip between the pages okay mother magic and ritual ronald nelson tc Modern magic and ritual is a, def a definite guide to the subject of magic for the new age, as opposed to magic for stage magicians. Okay. Written for practitioners to hone their knowledge and art, this book examines in detail all aspects of modern magic and offers readers a rich menu of rituals to practice. Okay, can I flip through pages? That flip through, right? From TC. There you go. New Age Curses. Whether you believe in karmic consequences or not, there are ethical considerations to magic such as curses and hexes. These clearly have great implications and other ethical conundrums, like casting love spells or on another person. Some paths forbid it entirely, while others permit it only in self-defense. However, there are a number of questions that practitioners should ask before casting a harmful spell. Do you dwell too much on the desired results? You may experience disappointment and depression if the result is not what you expected. Are you performing this magic for personal gain? Emotions of avarice may, or envy might interfere, uh, interfere with the magic. It is said that if you don't let go of a grenade, you eventually blow yourself up. The same can be said of working harmful magic. Even if you don't believe in a rule of three, it is always best to cleave to Rod Rudolf Steiner's golden rule. For every one step that you take in the pursuit of higher knowledge, Take three steps in the perfection of your own character. Knowledge of higher worlds and its attainment, 1904. Then we have the illustration of a lock of hair. Lock of hair, the hair of a living person can be used in many forms of magic, from love spells to curses. When mixed with sulfur and buried, it can inflict harm on the subject. Well, that sounds great. Wait, let's go back one. Oh, secret found. Give me a second. So casting love spells on another is... Um, Underlined and take three steps in the perfection of your own character. It's underlined. So, sun and moon. The sun and moon are important to the practical magician. The sun represents death and rebirth of God, whose cycle is marked by the wheel of the year. The sun is born at the winter solstice, matures in spring, flourishes at the summer solstice, then wanes in autumn and winter before being reborn. It sustains life, helps the growth of nature that feeds us, and keeps us warm. The moon represents the divine goddess, queen of haven, heaven. She is the keeper of mysteries, ruler of psychic powers and unseen realms. The moon is identified with women's menstrual cycles. It phases, its phases are aspects of the triple goddess, so that the waxing moon represents a young maiden, the full moon is a pregnant mother, and the new moon is the crone. The sun and moon represent the cosmic balance of male and female universal forces. Around these symbols revolve revolve many mysteries of human existence such as love passion fertility death and rebirth as well as the afterlife they inspire a modern magician traditional wiccan covens own honor the goddess of the aspects the full moon while druidic traditions celebrate the solar solstices and equinoxes so then we have another illustration sun and moon these magic charms represent male and female the cosmic lovers they provide good luck protection and fertility for couples okay that's interesting well the couple that we have so far is taylor and and daniel right so let's see if we can go back the other way as well no it doesn't look like it i can only go two ways okay We go now i want to see uh secrets there we go we found the secret a book titled modern magic and ritual with the initials t tc on the cover it describes how the sun is a symbol of masculine magic and the moon is a symbol of feminine magic images of these symbols are circled okay That I see, but we can go in. On to the examine. 
grab my hand or anything. Oh, there we go. Her. We saw stuff with the gun, but I don't remember what it was. Okay, well we have it now. You all done with that poking old? around? Uh, serious? Let's say that we found a gun. Let's not keep that found a secret. This inside. What the hell are you doing with a gun? It was hidden under the floor. You should have left it there. Guns are dangerous. We're already in enough trouble. Uh. Yeah, I do think they're dangerous because we were holding it to the I bus driver's right. head. Give it to me. Oh, I hope that's not going to get us in trouble. Andrew showed Angela the gun and she threw it away. Oh, I hope that's not going to get us in trouble. I just. Okay, let's look at the. Which one? I think we should have kept it. Break! I think we should have kept it. Break, break. Back inside, imagine. Or here as well, right? Oh no. Okay. Oh, freak! Are we gonna die now? Oh no. I just remember the other one that we found where we were holding it to the bus driver's head. So I thought maybe we shouldn't keep it, <laughs> unless the bus driver is bad. What kind but... of place is this? Like a theme park, you know. Everything is in the theme of witches, and it's basically one big roller coaster ride. <laughs> Let's think of it like that, okay? Don really, really <laughs> just ran off. Just leaving us behind. Your time there, Angela. Uh, let's walk a little faster. Professor? Yeah, where did you go? Oh, he's there. I didn't even get past this. Oh, it's it's open. Well, there you are. <laughs> there you go. Uh I mean, I understand running away. That was crazy back there. Sorry I took off like that. I'm more twitchy than I thought. Thanks for coming after me. What the hell was that in there? Don't worry about it. It was nothing. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it? What am I? In second grade? He's right. Get over yourself and move on. Sometimes they react poorly to things that I wouldn't expect them to react poorly to. You would like me to, to make fun of you instead? This place is our best shot. Oh, is it? There must be a radio or a working phone inside. Maybe even our driver, too. Look around for something we can break the glass with. First, I want to see if we can find secrets. Is that a stone? Yeah, that's going to continue. Okay, let's not do that. So it does show us when we're going to continue. That's good to know. Anything else here? Let's move the other way then. Even our fast walking isn't very fast. <laughs> talk to either of them. Maybe he's gonna find it though. Fast enough. There you go. Let's examine that. And you like grab my hand? Okay. Premonition unlocked. Mercy. So, if we help her, that's good. 
What was familiar, right? Familiars. I don't understand what they mean by that. But that's the one with the gun where it shows that we should have a gun. Anything else? Let's just get the rock then. Like that was all that we could do. Okay, so we should be helping Angela whenever we get a chance, I guess. Oh, that was interesting. Give me that. <laughs> that was an interesting shot. <laughs> I'll smash the window. No problem. I can do this. Okay. If you're sure. Anyone can do this. Not anyone. Putting You're a rock through a window at 10 paces, anyone can make the shot. If you're feeling under pressure, let someone else do it. Oh my I'm god, what's happening? Right. Just saying. Can you stop talking? Will you just get on with it? The frame will have rotted away and the glass will fall out on its own before you two have finished. Okay. There you go. Oh, strike! We'll make a ball player out of you yet. Do you think a rookie can make a shot like that? Well, they all liked it. They're happy that I managed to hit it. <laughs> Looks safe enough. Piece of cake. Mm. You're up next. Okay, well, it's just two of us. We're probably gonna die first because we split up. You believe that we're clearly not the smartest of the group. I don't know what John saw, and I don't intend on sticking around to find out. I don't want to go to an abandoned school, guys. Oh, sure, yeah. Did you guys see that? The little girl running. noise yeah I'm sure it's nothing what was that that's gonna continue then oh but I saw see things here no surprise that didn't sell Who'd want land in this godforsaken town? I want to live in nature, but not just nature, though. See, yeah, I just want to get this. I'm not gonna get it, though. The fog is... Ah, no. Can't get it. Okay, well... I guess we'll just continue, then. wonder what closed the school down. Forget about that! Even if you make it over, there's no way I'm following. I never did like school. It's <laughs> oh, looks like there's no way through. I might have made a bad call here. Yeah. Collective decision. Hey, it was a collective decision. We'll find another way. Be kind. Maybe now we can continue. Follow the little girl. That seems smart. Little Hope. 1692. Follow the little girl. Great. Okay. And I saw this as well. A little hope rage playground. Oh, don't don't send us to a playground. Are you kidding me? We're gonna go to a playground? Oh no. Oh, I hate that. Oh, I hate that.
have to. Going in there. Guess we have to. Another one of these symbols. Oh, that's the sun and the moon. We just read about that. Fast. I don't like that. It's fast. Oh god. It was on four legs. I don't like that. Heart rate is up, guys. Wings are slowly swinging around. Drawing, fun, made by a kid. Always good. Find these things that we. Is that it? That was it. What is um arrogant? Okay, so. My theory is to unlock these. I don't even know if we want to unlock these, but I think to unlock these, we probably should act arrogant, right? Because that's like our other... Or shouldn't we? I don't know. <laughs> no, I'm confused again. I don't know. We act arrogant or the opposite? Over there! Don't go follow her in that dark tunnel. Hey, are you okay? Oh, concerned. Let's be concerned. Who are you? What are you doing here? Something is real off about this whole thing. Is this the same little kid Angela and Andrew saw before? I have no clue. Whoa, you can't be doing that. Yeah. Didn't just happen. Quiet now. Be cold. What are you talking about? Get away, or he will find me. Shh, be quiet. <gasps> Don't ruin it for her. Oh, is she found already? Yeah, she's Come on found. Out, Mary. I know very well you're in there. Please, no, let me go. I will release you once I'm sure you will not speak of our secret. Your childish games tire me. You will respect me, and you will say nothing. No! Uh, let go over? Let go over right now! Oh! What spell have you cast? I am frozen to my marrow. I have done nothing. Amy is the caster of spells. She is the one in league with the devil. I saw her in the forest together with her familiars. I am innocent. I will have the truth one way or another. You come with me, girl. Thank you kindly. Be silent, child. Was that smart? Or did we get her in trouble? Can someone tell me what just happened? Those two kids have to be linked somehow. No way that's a coincidence. I... I don't get it. Let's not hang around here. It's time to go. Yeah, we know there's a right monster. Uh, wasn't the monster somewhere here though? Uh, the postcard. Ooh. Oh, it's Angela again. Another premonition unlocked. Like a stone. So I think they're just named after what happens. 
So like a stone, human sacrifice, mercy, deadly omen. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do with those. Except for the fact that we clearly should be here. Again. You're glad I'm here. <laughs> Doesn't seem like that to me. Okay, guys, let's not fight. Like I started that because <laughs> I made the wrong decision all the way in the beginning by saying he's not my boyfriend. What did I know? Her. Could mean someone's around. Maybe they can help. Let's head over. Let me help you. I don't know when I need to smash it or when I just need to hit it once. I feel like they're still letting us practice for when we really need to run. Get back to the other group? I don't think this takes oh. us out of this shitty town. There's no road. Must lead somewhere, though. I'm not so sure. There's barely even a path. Hearing is that sounds in real life or in the game? Oh, I don't even know. That scares me. I don't like that I don't know if it's in real life or not. <laughs> Place must have been a grocery store or something. Stop the Ravenden factory well. closure. Jobs, not land? A lot here. Gonna continue. Gonna continue. Ah. Probably gonna continue too. Then I just want to try to road, shouldn't we? What are we doing? We should get going. Just cool it for a second, will you? I don't want to cool it. I want to get out of here. Is this where you came from? Oh, this is where you came from, isn't it? Yeah. So the road. Ooh, that's really fucking creepy. Ooh, I don't like that. Well, I want to see then. Uh, secrets. Oh, we have a few of them. Rune stones used in some kind of ritual. The rumors of witchcraft within Little Hope seem to have some substance. And then the rumors of witchcraft. Okay, seems to have some substance. We have that. So the update, I see. Discarded science from a protest against the closure of the Ravenden factory. Ravenden? Ravenden? Right. There we go. <laughs> Okay, now we can go try the door. Well, at least we're finding some secrets, you know? Oh yeah, we still have this. Seems like he's gonna use it as a weapon, maybe. Oh no, he's gonna push it aside. Never mind. Over here, look at this. Hope for a little hope. The carvers want to close the something factory, Raven and Factory, and sell the land mm -hmm, development. For development, I guess? Mm -hmm would result in the mm -hmm and devastate the community. The union has proposed an offer to save the factory and our town. Please sign our petition to persuade the Carver family to accept the union offer. Wasn't it Re Revenant Car? No, Carson. Never mind, not Carver. Persuade the Carver family to accept the union offer and reverse uh, their decision. Ask for detail from staff at the post office or town hall. Citizens for a little hope and. T 
TLUA local 618. Okay. That's it. Well, let's try a door then. Did I try? Oh no, that was continue. Yeah, that was continue. We should try the door. It's probably locked, right? Yeah. Well, let's just find another way. Let's not let people know we're here. Or so you can try this or that. Or now what? Give me a leg up. I'm going for the stairwell. If I really have to. Out of metal, metal or wood? Seriously? Weddle. <laughs> You're going in there? Yeah. Let me go in, look around. If it's all clear, I'll come and open the door. I'm not sure. I don't like the idea of being out here on my own. Fair enough. Be right back. Promise. Can we take her up? Like, can we hoist her up? Dark. I need your phone. What for? Flashlight. It's dark in there. Please be quick. Throw it to me. Oh no, that's... Oh god. <laughs> Good. Lemon squeezy. I'm in. Is it safe? Think so. Stop shouting. Oh. Notice of closure. Okay. Effective June 28, 1975. We wish to inform you that on Saturday, June 28, the store will close. Sadly, due to the decline in business since the closure of the factory, we are unable to continue trading. However, Whiteman Mart wishes to thank all its customers for their support over the years. Yours, J. Smith and A. Lash, General Managers. Stock to remove. Snacks, magazines, alcohol, firearm, toba uh, tobacco, gas, oil, da dairy, eggs, produce, bread, dry goods, cans, electrical goods, and miscellaneous. So magazines are still here. Cans are still here. Ele uh, electrical goods are still here. And miscellaneous is still here, I'm guessing. Put on some lights, maybe? Or here. Can we do anything with the door? No. Gonna bring us down? Yeah. Let's not do that. That. Different angle? Yeah. I have to do that. Okay. There's a door here as well. Oh my god. Sorry guys, the controls are a bit wonky sometimes. Probably my fault, but <laughs> we got another one. Oh, great. Premonition unlocked. Ritual blade. We don't know if it's good or bad. Local minister arrested. Okay, dated June 14, 1973. Local minister arrested. A minister in the Diocese of Pleasant River has been arrested after complaints from concerned parents about his behavior. The arrest comes after recent revelations that the minister conducted an uh, alleged satanic mass. Okay. An eyewitness said that the minister of St. David's Church in Little Hope did not resist as he was escorted from his home. Captain Daniel McGuire confirmed that Revenant Leonard Carson, that's it, Carson, 42 years old, was being held in custody at the Little Hope Police Department awaiting charges. A spokesman from St. De uh, David's commented, I've never seen the minister do anything untowards. His interest in witchcraft was purely academic and he would often warn parents of the uh, spiritual dangers of the cult. Another parishioner who did not wish to be named claimed that the minister was innocent of wrongdoing. That child is known as an uh, attendant. Uh, attention seeker, and I'm certain she has made up the story. 
Other members of the congregation agreed. Reverend Carson was a good man, a godly man, said one mother to all three. I can't believe he'd do anything like this. He'd been good to our family. These accusations are lies. The district attorney's office did not respond to calls. When contacted, the office of uh, Diocese of Pleasant River stated that the bishop had declined to comment, but that a deacon? But that a deacon. Okay, I don't know what that means. Her. But this is not about Mary, right? Because that's before the time of papers. Right? Supposed to go down here. Uh, I just want to see pictures we have. Homegrown hero? Daniel demanded that the priest let go of Mary. Okay, so we're a hero now. <laughs> Uh, Mary claimed to be innocent to the priest and direct a blame at Amy. Yeah, we, I saw that. So she directed the blame basically at um, Angela. That's the same, right? So we're, we're starting to get quite a few of the bearings for this one. So secrets, we have more. Uh, Reverend Carson used the occult to his advantage. There you go. Reverend Carson was obsessed with the occult. So we're learning all these new things now. The Carver family tried to sell the factory as a part of land deal of a land deal. Carver, not Carson, yeah. The name of the factory the Carver family was trying to close was the Ravidon factory. Yeah, we know that. Okay. Well, guys, <laughs> I think we're going to end this episode here for now before we drop down in the, the dark, scary hole. Because that seems perfect to save for next time. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Won't you spare me over to another?